today I'm going to show you how to make your website using the code.org web lab. This is what it's called web lab. You start it empty, like only the first page, which is index.html. Usually, when you add an HTML page, it's going to be showing directly. So you can use this as your first um, page which is always index.html and the second page can be anything let's rename it um, okay um, traveling for example so because this um, web lab will give you directly the basic HTML code which you can just write your content right away because the HD index doesn't have that you can just copy it and paste it so you, there you have it now you have two pages already which nothing yet there's nothing so then add another HTML like I'm going to talk about my hobby so one is traveling one is um, blogging for example okay so I have three three um, pages right now that is ready to be added content but what if in the school you cannot connect to the Wi-Fi and it is loading so you just have to go to your notepad not notes not notepads we can make from notepads but um, just because you need to copy paste it to this page from notepad to copy paste to your web lab so you just need to make it anywhere so now make a new folder in your notes the folder will be my website okay and then you make a new note which you can copy paste this or if you don't have access to this you can go to w3schools.com and there's this html sample that you can copy paste and put it here then you can write your content here and then when you're done you just um, at home when you have access you can copy paste it here why don't you do it directly here because in the class that I'm teaching they are doing it using this note, notes and then at home they have to just copy paste it they don't do it at home anyway um, this is a little bit too big because I make it for them to see okay now let's go to here this is the body opening tag and closing tag whatever you want to put your picture your um, content everything will be shown in here this is the title of the website my website will be like my personal or my hobbies and then this is a heading I'm going to change it to the title of my website which is okay I can give the same thing to my hobbies and this is a paragraph I can change it to hi guys to share my hobbies with you and what I love to do in my spare time just like that so you can copy paste and put it in index well this is a nice layout with indentation and everything but just copy paste that 
it's coming nice also even though this is just a straight line it is coming already um, indented so this is my hobbies and this is my um, um, paragraph okay now I need to put some photo images for example an image um, I don't know what photo I can put right now don't have really okay for example this I have to wait until it's loading uploading is it a big picture yeah um, then I'm just gonna write I'm gonna make H2. H2 is the second heading, which is um, traveling. is my hobby. And then H2. Okay. And this, I want to link it, this, to my second page. So I need to put. Um, href in between first a space href equal this and what I name I name this traveling.html now so I have to put this the same exact um, yeah and then Just going to put this the closing tag of A. Uh, close the tag. Now let's see. Okay, photo can be later. Now I need to put it. See? It's Clicking, it's clickable. So this is how you make your link to your second page, just like that. Just keep copy pasting it, and then when you click it, traveling. Is it correct? Yes, it should be. When you click it, you are referred to this. H2 Do you find the mistake here? Anchor href equal Queen Continue So this is the, the traveling when you click it it is taking to the traveling HTML and it's still empty how to link back to the index okay I'm making a second page of my web page so this is traveling and I need to write a new one so this is the second one I'll copy paste from here or from W3C. Let's copy it from here. Now that's my second one. You just have to remember 
because for me this one cannot be renamed and this one cannot be renamed so I'm gonna make um, in the body traveling H1 P P and then I need to <clears throat> link it to the first website first page on top of this I put it This is the kind of thing that you need to pay attention to. So now it's linked. See, when you click this traveling, it goes to this traveling page, and when you go back to home, click it and you go back to index. Until now, you understand, and you can do another for this second, the third page. The third page you can do as well, like that. Um, in this third page, I'm going to make a new page here. That's another. So this is page one, page two, page three. Copy paste from here. And then I'm gonna put in the body H1. Vlogging. Then, sorry about the noise. I love to capture to capture my journeys as a vlog to share to others. It's gonna be P paragraph and then P is opening. That's it. This is simple, right? Then I'm gonna add pictures, I'm gonna add more and more um, content in it. But then I'm going to link it to home. href Here. H1. Okay. Then 
is it going back? I just I need to change this because for some reason it doesn't create. Alright, now go back to index. And then in index I have to go to <coughs> give for another for blogging H2 H2 and then I'll have to click and close and open the graph form. Here there's a drop down that you can choose which one you want to be blogging and then close it and the text blogging open slash a So that save it. Yeah. I'll see. Thank you. Vlogging, and then when you click it, it's going there. Okay. So for now, I hope you understand how to make the um, website using WebLab and also copy pasting it from the mod the mods. Alright, bye. Waiting for your submissions.